Hello, my YouTube world. Um, just here to do some Poshmark. I started, I did a video before um, my journey on Poshmark. Um, I guess I'm just gonna continue doing some stuff. I have, like, I'm not doing as well on Poshmark as how some of these people talk about but i'm gonna show you guys some stuff that i will be posting so if you do want to go over to my poshmark and purchase some stuff from me to help a sister out because you know i'm not working right now so i'm kind of looking for some extra cash on the side so i'll be showing you some showing you guys some stuff that i will be posting on my poshmark closet and you can go there and shop my prices are pretty decent and I honestly do not refuse any offer. Barely, I can't even tell what, if I've ever refused any offer. I always uh, just accept, accept, and accept. So, well, be reasonable, people, be reasonable. Okay, so I will be going through and showing you some stuff that I will be posting to my Poshmark closet. So stay tuned. that I have here is a top and the back is like this it's like an open back and it has like a sheer thing underneath it and this is from forever 21 is it yes forever 21 so these ones I normally price um, anywhere from 12 to 15 dollars I'm very reasonable and um this is a cardigan i didn't even tell you guys the size of that one this one is size medium and it's a cardigan and you can see it is a juicy couture cardigan and guys honestly sometimes if you don't buy them i'm gonna end up keeping them um so this is a cardigan it's um, in the size medium it may fit small also yeah so this will be posted up there. I'm not sure of the, how much I'm going to price it for. And it has the Juicy Couture symbol on the side of the pocket right there. So not sure how much I'm going to price that one for yet because it's an Ayer brand. This one I'm not going to sell. That one was something. Okay, this. Let me remove this tag from it. This one I bought and... I never wore it I just removed the tag from it I bought it and I never worn it I don't know if I would ever wear it because I have it for over a year now and I was just going to my closet whatever um, I have that I haven't worn in the last year to six months then I'm just gonna get rid of them so this one I haven't worn I just removed the ticket off of it it's like a three-quarter sleeve bell sleeve and it's um, off the shoulder and this is by Fashion Nova, Fashion Nova, and um, I believe this is in the size medium because that's what I wear, and it still has the belt and everything to it. I'm not sure how much I'm gonna price this one for as yet either. Um, <clears throat> I have a lot of them, so I'm just doing partial videos. This one is like um, a sweater that can be worn in the springtime. Um, it's like backless. It has a little bit of peep peak all in the back you can you can either bring it up as close as you want so that you, your back doesn't show as much and this is by the brand Derek and Hart and it's in the size large I'm thinking is it either large kids but this isn't large I wear size medium and I've worn this already I think I've worn it once and I think it's pretty cute long sleeve and again that price will be in the price range between fifteen dollars this one is again let me remove this i just remove the price tag off of it this one is the brand miss 60. miss 60. i should be posting this and honestly i think i purchased it 
and I haven't worn it. I may be posting it because I'm not sure if I really want to sell it. But I will let me know. If you like it, let me know. And if you're willing to purchase it, then I'll sell it. But other than that, I may not post. I may not post it. But this is, and it has the zipper here. It's very stylish. And this is something I usually wear to work. It, it's very stylish. I like it. And it's like in a stone wash kind of jeans. Another one here is a, I wasted, and I'm gonna remove the tag again from here. I didn't know I have so much stuff with tags that I've never worn. So I don't, have I not wear this pants before? I thought I did, but probably not, because I have a lot in these kind of stuff. So this is the brand by Blue Paris. I'm not sure in the size medium, medium and it was made in Italy. No, India. So I think one of the reasons why I personally haven't worn it, it has a short stuff inside, so it's like a slip, so it shouldn't be thin, but I don't know. I guess it's good for like spring, summer, and it's eye-waisted again, and it has two pockets, and the belt is with it. I'm not sure how much I'm, I will be pricing these for. It's normally run between 19 and $15. And again, there is another one, almost the same thing. Probably that's why I thought I wore it before. This one I for sure wore before. I think I wore it to church. And this one is by Forever 21. I was honestly obsessed with these kind of style of pants. And I will be selling these ones also. And it still has the belt. Everything is intact. So... Check out my Poshmark and I will be putting it up here. Again, I will be removing another tag from a short shorts that I purchased. I'm not a shorts person. I don't know why I bought this. I, I, I don't know where I was going, but I bought the shorts and I buy it with the intention of wearing it somewhere and I wasted just like the other pants. And um, this is, I'm not sure. I'm trying to see where this tag is from, but I don't recognize it. This is an extra small size, weight 20, waist 24, 25. And you know what? Probably I bought it with the intention of wearing it because it looks big, but it's actually small. And well, I'm not a shorts wearer anyways, but yeah, this will be in my Poshmark closet. Another one I have here, it's by Kimichi Blue. I use, I, I love Kimichi stuff. I think their stuff is cute. Kimichi Blue and it's in the size six. I really love this. I wore it before a couple of times and it's like wide legged. It's wide leg, so it's, yeah. Not sure how much I will be pricing this, but it shouldn't be, again, no more than $19. I have this top. It was one of my go-to top that I worn so much, take so many pictures in. It's by BB. And um, yeah, we'll be selling it, getting rid of it. And it's in the size medium. And it's black, so it goes with everything. And I'm not sure how much I will be pricing that for. I have a belt that I have never worn. And it's by Calvin Klein. And I believe, or I probably wear it a couple of times, but it's in size large and it says Calvin Klein there. It says Calvin Klein here. It's in size large and I think it was way, it wraps around my, my waist a couple of times and it feels uncomfortable, so I haven't been wearing it. This one I bought, I thrifted it, DNG. It's real leather and I know it's the real stuff, but Again, it's maybe in the size large and it wrapped around my waist a few times and it's uncomfortable. So I will be selling this in my Poshmark also closet. Not sure why I have this in here because this is my personal, my top. So why am I selling that top? <laughs> so no, I'm not selling this. I love this top. Uh, there's no way I'm going to sell this one. It's for, by Forever 21, but I just so love the cut there. 
and I wore it once and I get so many compliments in it so no way I'm gonna sell it I don't know how some of my stuff got into this but no it's not for sale not for sale this pants is by Moschino Moschino I always say most it's on here uh, I don't know I let me see if there's a tag inside I believe I thrifted this so I'm not sure if it's real or if it's not I was told it was real but I didn't like outfit it's in the size 27 and I don't, I, um, I, I don't know I think because I have a stomach it didn't look flattering on my stomach so I decide that I'm gonna sell it it has pockets here it has a little jawstring there and zipper here and pocket there and as, as I said it's in the size 20 27 this is a Wilfred pants it's in size 0 I think I had it posted before and someone purchased it but it was too small for them so they returned it so I am gonna repost it and it's in the um, it's in the color grayish uh, future fusion fu whatever it is gray so yeah and this is in size zero and I believe I had it I had it posted for either $35 I'm not sure but it probably is gonna be between the 35 between 35 $30 around that Again, another one of those pants. Um, I want another one of these eye waisted. Is it? Yeah, it is an eye waisted pants, but it's not gathered. Again, it has the belt, and this is by Zara. Nice color, and it's in the color. It's like an olive green color. I'm pretty sure I wore it before, but I don't wear these things very often. I probably wear them once or twice the most. This one, I don't believe I've ever... I don't know if I want to sell this, but let me know if you are interested. It's by Free People. And it's just like a elastic waisted regular pants, great for the summer. It's a little bit wide at the bottom there, so it looks cute with like a basic white t-shirt in the summer I'm not quite sure if I want to sell it but if someone here likes it let me know and I'll post it so you can purchase it and I bought this pants and for the life of me I could not find a top to go with it um, it's Adidas and it's in the size <sighs> what size is it but I love it though size medium and it's just cute I love it and it has like a light pink um, the Adidas stripe there and it's like navy blue and I like the leg there it's wide and you can pull the string to get it a little bit um, closer so it's cute and it has the Adidas sign there it's it's cute the price range maybe in the $35 range too. I've never worn that one either. I have it for probably a year and a half now and I haven't gotten the chance to wear it. So yeah, I decided to sell it. This one is a dress pants and it is by J. Crew. Used to wear it to work. And here's the legging of it. And again, it might be in the rate um, in the 30s between $35-28 but again I said I accept all offers reasonable offers size 6 and this is Banana Republic I should say and it's like black dress pants again great for interviews or office work and it has pockets Mac yeah, it's not real pack pockets. Mac pockets at the back and it should have let me see. Yeah, they don't yeah, just you can put pennies in there, I guess. 
But yeah, that's it. And another one I have here is by Club Monaco. This is... Um... Is it a pants? I'm not sure. It's those, um, I don't remember what they call it, those three quarter pants. So it's in the stripe, dark blue and white. Oh my gosh, my eyes are going. It's either black or dark blue and white. I believe it's blue. And it has those pockets at the back. It doesn't have any pockets. And then it has, um, if you want to wear a belt and, or anything around it, you're able to do that. Another Miss 60 Pants. I know I've worn this, but ain't fitting me anymore. As I said, I have a gut and I need to work on it because guess what? I need to fit into a bathing suit by the end of, by summer. So I should be going on some diet sometime, but it's not fitting me as how it should. It's just my belly's hanging over. So I decided I'm going to get rid of it and it's Miss 60 and it's in the color black and it has the zipper on the side here two pockets at the back and pockets at the front the zipper everything is working great and intact another pants here street wear society i don't know i'm not a big fan of their brand but at the time I purchased this, I was in love with all of these embroidery thing that's going on. I worn it a few times too. And I love the end, I mean the end of this. It's all like, so I love it. This, I, I, I really love it. So I bought it. I don't know if I'm gonna ever wear it again because I haven't worn it from my, wore it sometime last year. I haven't. What I, what I mean last year is probably early 2019 I wore it and I haven't worn it again so I'm gonna get rid of it as I said if I haven't wear them within the last year to six months I'm getting rid of them this is America American Apparel and it's eye-waisted and I honestly love this jeans but it's too tight it's too small for me right now again my stomach is and it's just perfect it's just a perfect jean. yeah it's just a perfect jeans so this one will be in my closet also so go there and purchase if you're interested in it I have a few tops left I have this top that I probably wore once um, not sure of the brand Coos I think I bought it because of the um, this bounce there and I think I buy it because I was into these kind of sleeve these jawstring sleeves and I think I wore it once and it's like um, a crop top so this it's a long sleeve again good for the springtime um, winter springtime so yeah this will be in my closet all my winter stuff will be going on sale on sale soon uh, this is another semi crop top and here you go, it has the racing cars logo thingy on here. And it is in the size medium. Majority of my stuff is either medium or small, maybe large. Um, social edition. I'm not sure what brand that this is, but I purchased it at a good price and I wore it probably once. So yeah, this will be in my closet also and I have a Zara I wasted pants in the color dark blue and it's again it's white wide legged at the bottom which is what we're in now a lot of wide leg pants are in style right now so this is it I have another top here that I'm gonna get rid of and I believe it's it's by Nike and it's kind of cute because it has like um has a lot of fur on it though so it's a nike it has a slit at the side right there it has like a cotton thing going on there but then yet a stylish fashionable thing going on in the back right there so it's kind of cute and this is in the size medium and i don't remember if i ever worn this but maybe i 
worn it. And the last thing I have to show you is this belt. And it's by Baumim and who? Baumim and H&M when they um, collaborate. I bought it with the intention of wearing it. And when I got home, I didn't try it. When I got home, it never fit. And I thought this was so cute. So it's right there. So if you're into these vintage looking, and I love it because it's, I'm a vintage girl. And it's, it's really cute. Everything is intact. Everything is great. It's the tag right here, but it's not fitting me. So I will be selling those. So all of these will be posted in my Poshmark. By the time this video goes up, it will already be posted into my Poshmark closet. So if you are a Poshmark buyer, then hit me up. I will put my Poshmark link below and somewhere in the video somewhere. And yeah, there was... I will be posting a lot now that I'm home and free. <laughs> so I will be posting a lot of pictures so you can go on my Poshmark and check it out and you know, eat a sister up and make some, you know, send some doughs over my way and I'll, I'll give you a good price. I, as I said, I am a reasonable seller and I really don't decline anything or unless you are really dis disrespectful. Like if I post, for example, if I post something for $35 and you offer me five bucks or say you offer me $15, I'm $15. I will probably counter offer, but, um, five bucks. No way. Don't do that. Don't disrespect me. Um, I pay a lot of money for my stuff. My things are quality and it's, I already wear my stuff. Hardly wear my stuff because I wear majority jeans to work and I just have my favorite stuff that I just wear most of the time. So, and because I'm not wearing them, they're just ugging up space in my closet and I just need to weed out some stuff. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys have a great day, a great week and a great month. And don't forget to subscribe guys. Give me some big thumbs up and help a sister out. Help her sister out on YouTube. And if you subscribe and you have a YouTube channel, I will go back and subscribe to you. Thanks. See you in my next video.